Hello guys, today I want to show you how you can make a form using Microsoft Access. So, you open the file explorer, select the location where you want to, to save your database. So you come near, I open mine, I save it, form, I open it. After opening it, I'm supposed to enable the content. After enabling the content, I come and create, then table design, then I say name, I type name, class, name is a reserved word, so I can, uh, instead of writing it, I can say Gina, caption I say name, name, age, what, uh, admission number, Admission number, then I can say form stream uh -huh. the date that I was enrolled. And then you can come and see the class teacher. Then from there, I can come in place of admission. Uh, I'm checking the data types class teacher later. since it's a class teacher's name you can say it, let it be a long text written rule let it be date and time uh -huh. stream let it be lookup wizard it can be stream n e stream w stream s then if come and finish mm -hmm. it can also be stream in place of form let it be form 1 form 2 form 3 form 4 so user look up with that i will take the values that i want then select next let it be 1 2 3 4 then we finish Admission number, let it, it can be also a short text, general short text. So let's confirm again if reading is fine. It's okay, then you save it. Before even you save it, you can come and make admission number the primary key, then you save it. Let's say students. Press OK. From there, you can come. You see how the the table will look like this. The tables, for example, can I enter my name? Um, it's Kenya. Enter my name, Kenya. I can say admission number. It can be 8741. I can come then select here. I can say I'm in form for I'm in stream S. I was enrolled back in. Uh -huh. You can select depending the way you want. Like for this case, I can, in case I can select that date. Class teacher name, I can say Mr. Waveru. Mr. Waveru. Then I can save. To, for you to save, you can press Ctrl S. Then you save. Like for this case, I wanted to uh, create a form. So in, I will come and say create. Like the other menu is to create a form, you can come and trust form design, form, more forms. There are many ways to make a form, but for this case, I will just press form since it is a simple one. Here it will look like this, but instead, uh, I can also edit it, make it more beautiful. This is how we edit it. You come, you come to design view. So this is uh, how you want to design the form. I can press there. I can change the handwriting to uh, monotype. I uh, can put it color black there. Font color can also change it to color. I can put it even yellow. Mm -hmm. I come to here. Also edit it. I can put it color maroon. Then I play put text font color color white then I can also change the font st mm, style 
so you can put okra extended from there mm -hmm. you can also come here and say uh, students details I can also edit it. I can come and put a uh, here. I can say the to be Algerian. Algerian, please uh, align it at the center. Mm -hmm. What else? I can also place the background color to be like that color. Mm -hmm. Then the text color can be color also be black from there I can also come and design the form the background of the form the whole form so I'll come here property sheet I select form after I select form I can come here picture I click the three buttons then you come and select where your pictures, the location of your pictures. For example, for mine, you can see they are in the downloads. From, since they are not appearing, you come and see all files. They will come and show up here. You can select any. You can come and see download. Select that one. In the uh, as you can see, there is a small uh, image in the background. I can make it more bigger. Me put more time. I want to make it more beautiful. Clip mm -hmm. center. From there, uh -huh. I can add buttons in my form so as to make it more to add help me to add more data. For example, I can come and place a button. You come to the design. Come and select this box button. I come and say record. Add new record. Then I finish. I can come and put, uh, so put another one like save record. Uh, I finish. I can also add another button for deleting it. Uh, for record operations deleting finish I can also edit a button the buttons by come format mm -hmm. you can see the shape effect uh, uh, change shape I can put this shape I can change the color of the buttons I can put it more color. green From there, I want to view my form. You come to home, then you view how it will be looking like. You see from view. This is how it will be looking like, but I can save. First, you save. Control S. Students form. Students form. form. And from there, I can view it. I can try to add data, for example, add record. I can add JSON, JSON, add visual number, I can just get any number. Form, I can say, is in stream, form 4, form 3. Stream, I can say, is in stream, rest, date and roll. I can come and select just any date I can put date 7 this month class teacher then I can say Mr. Vishai Mr. Korea we can also add another record for example we can say we can add Thomas Thomas Mission number just guess in it just for the meantime you can just guess any 
info we can say is info one. We can come select here say is the next. Right and road, you can say then yesterday. I did like yesterday. You can also say class teacher, you can also just guess is T2. Then you save the record. After saving, then you come to the table where you come, you want to update the table, so you come, you just refresh it. You have seen it has added the name of the student, Thomas, admission number, form, class, date, and the name of the class teacher. So, as you can see in my in the form, you are not able to go to the next record, not back, not to the back to the previous record. So I want to add a button, which will help us do be able to either to go to the next record or previous record. So we come design button, which is a button. Then you say come to the record navigation. Then you say previous record. Just then click finish. Come again. Again, the next button will be next record. Just finish. Then for in order to for the purpose of beautifying the form, we just edit them. Same case if you want to add other buttons like the print button, the quit and any application button. Same case, just gonna create a button, then you go and find the function, give it, you give it the function that you want. So from there, that's how my uh, my form is. Let let's test the uh, test the two buttons. So we come still come back to home. Review the form form view. For example, you can see just able to navigate. Same if you also want to find uh, to put the find button, uh, the search button. Same case with Lopri, just uh, need to put a button, then you give it a function. So guys, so that's how you make a simple simple form in Access. Please guys, do subscribe, share, and comment. Thank you.